for the opening tip in a moment. Our officials for this game, Andre Patillo, Gary Markham, and Curtis Shaw. Three players in this league, but he comes up empty. Owens with a pull-up. Long rebound to Gibson. Gibson right in the right spot. The right. He's a good ball fake and a finger roll. And much as was the case against Kentucky, the Tigers come out on fire early at home. So we say they're smoke player of the year. Everybody else can have one. He's mine. He's terrific. Good move by Caesar. There it's Caesar taking the dish right to the hole. And it's 8-2 LSU. Nolan already off the bench. He's upset with his defense right now. Remox. Thurman and Stewart keep it alive. This has been a problem for LSU, the lack of size down low. Arkansas needs to get something started from this perimeter. Thurman. Thank you. Just that. <laughs> yep. He's the guy you call on. Scotty Thurman. Sophomore from Ruston High School. Burns off a high speed. Boy, did Owens make a terrific pass there. Leader on the floor. Stewart, a turnaround. He does it every way. He can face up to the basket. He can play with his back to the basket. Clyde Stewart, one of the great, great Caesar on the wing. Oh, oh, it's really delivering that basketball. Clarence Caesar getting a blow after hitting four of his first five. That one's too easy. No help from Robachinko. Yeah, the shot gets in. Henderson will launch. And Henderson wins it this time. One of those nice matchups to watch off the ball, ladies and gentlemen. Off the pick. Robinson nails the three. Crawford set a very nice two by two. And still back in that zone defense. Wilson wants it back. Good steal that time by Gibson. Fourth turnover. Counted and a foul. Thurman. All right, see, Titus leaves. Yeah, he backed off. You know, he made a little touch on the arm, then backed off and said, I've guarded him. Forget it. Scotty Thurman's going to nail that. He's going to stick with him. And Dale Brown just shaking his head over it. Titus, a oh. runner on the other end, move, though. to atone for his defense. Tips down, and Alex Dillard brings it down. Miss Crawford down the floor, and he'll launch for three. Look out if he gets one. No one can hit him like he can. 12 in a game earlier this year. Caesar. Tim, he had to be standing on the Tigers' tail at the end of the bench over there when he let that one go. I mean, he was way deep in the corner. Loose ball, Brandon brings it down. Brandon a solo. Coast to coast. The rebound. And the finish rather than Arkansas. There's Burns finished by Gibson. LSU is getting the ball inside, Larry. Very uncharacteristic in both divisions. Make it to the big dance. Henderson. Yeah, that's inattention on Corey Beck's part. That was a very weak pass to the wing. LSU grabbed it and went to the other end. Well, the Tigers are playing terrific ball in this first half. This is their largest lead, 38 to 28, with five and a half to play. Thurman knocks down the three-pointer. Well, when they need one, there's the guy. That 48 percent. LSU could be in trouble. Thurman back again. After a 10-point lead, Arkansas has now reeled off a nice spurt of 10 to 3. Caesar answers with a three-pointer of his own. Instead of Henderson. And the offensive board to Arkansas. McDaniel a three. Arkansas starting to heat it up now. Counting in the opening half. Number one Arkansas. McDaniel used the screen very effectively. Robinson was out there and he rubbed him off. Got the defender hung up and got the hand chases it. And puts it back up. Nice rebound by Jamie Brandon and LSU now doing some work on the offensive end. He's been the most consistent player on both ends for Dale Brown all year. Again, Corey Peck with a very bad pass. Brandon. Yes, and it counts. seen that one all year. Williamson gets away from Caesar. Caesar gives it to Brandon. Down low. Swatted away by Robinson. Quick outlet to Dillard. 
vintage Arkansas. Activity is set to get underway when we return to Baton Rouge. Don't leave your trail and clear. Caesar spots up. Inside the arc, that's a deuce, but it's a nine-point LSU lead. Tim, he's having a monster evening. To push that ball. Burns. Boy, Andre Owens really getting down the floor. Beck on the other end. What a nice spin move that was by Corey Beck. He was one on three and went ahead. Ronnie Henderson does have three fouls. Beck again with that spin move on the inside. There's the dump down to Williamson. He's devastating down there. Yeah, Arkansas took it back. Yeah, just as you mentioned, Larry, they turn it up to another level, and the Tigers go play. Henderson spotting up for the tray. Short-armed it. And Williamson's on the loose. Well, that's the aspect of his game that makes him a future lottery pick. McDaniel for three. Arkansas really strong now. First lead since 14.06 mark of this game. Stewart wide open at the top. Well, Cardis Williamson draws the defense so well, and when they do, he just feeds it to Dwight Stewart. Nail that Jay. Caesar falling away baseline. Sometimes he makes the most hook in the paint. The only area of his game where you can really chastise him is that he's been unavailable in most of the games late. Remont knocks home a three-point. 70-67. Hogs by three. There's the dump down to Lee Wilson. All three easy for the Razorbacks. Nice look back together. Thurman for three. He can. Largest lead of the game for the Razorbacks. 75-67. Thurman's got to send it up. Oh, it does. You know, Dale Brown's just... Now they've got four and one looking for six, maybe seven. Thurman again. Chalk it up. you got to go guard him. Dale Brown pointing that out to Sean Gibson. Burns. Boy, Beck gets right in his face, just not allowing anything. Thurman with numbers. Trailer to Williamson. Big duck. Oh. Burns, count it, and a foul. On the other end, Henderson. Oh, what a duck! Did you see how far he reached? Back. Williamson followed. What created that tip in for Williamson was everybody went to help. Nobody there to block him off. Owens. Andre. Andre. Ties it at 83. Caesar for three. Hail to Caesar. 29 for Clarence. What a shot by Caesar. Thurman for three. The answer. Shot in Fayetteville, but LSU has not beaten Arkansas since they came into the league. Owen, 90 to 88, 48 seconds left. Seasons of 75, 76. Beck follows, and there's the final time. Still time. It's a three-point game. Dillard for three. Got it. We're tied with four seconds left. Caesar gets it into Owens. Owens at the buzzer. We're headed to overtime, and number one is holding. Dillard for three. He had time, and he's deadly when he has time. He hit the three to... Send it to overtime. Now he gives his Hogs a three-point lead. Caesar answers. 31 for Caesar. Williams 
Jackson wants to take it inside. He's wide open. What a drive. Nobody to help. Lanier Burns. 102 to 99. Arkansas by three. Henderson. Brandon. Owens a runner. LSU back with the lead. 103-102. 105 to play. Caesar. Oh, that's a career high. 105-103. Here we go again. Shot clock is off. Williamson wants it. He's got Burns inside if they'll get him the ball. Thurman off the pick from back. Oh, again. Scotty Thurman does it again. They're going to continue the play. Fayetteville revisited. Owens misses. Beck saves. It could be Fayetteville. It has to be a three. Brandon. It's over. And the Arkansas Razorbacks are number one holding and perhaps with a bullet. And you really have to feel for that man. Dale Brown and his Tigers fought valiantly. They lose their seventh straight game. Tim, two tough losses to this Arkansas club. LSU battled valiantly. Let's give credit to Nolan Richardson for getting Alex Dillard into the lineup when Owens was at the strike. Dillard nails it.